Hey man, um, I wanted to see if we can make it so that we can search by county. Uh, it makes a lot more sense here. Uh, this is the county government records that we'll be using in the future uh, for to do OCR. So these are the states that uh, support right now. Uh, currently I'm working in Texas because I live in Texas. So uh, once you enter here and with the, with the login, um, we can then search all these counties uh, unlimited. So let's say I live in Hood County, so I'm just going to click on that one. And then basically based on the document number that we pull, the book names or the grantor grantee, let's just go with my name. You can see where I live. Um, I think that's all oh, my grantee. I don't know. Let's go with that. You can then pull up the, the document number of my house. So here's the deeds, that's uh, where I bought it from, that's our, our living trust, and you can click on it and you can see the, uh, the the preview of this image here. Oh, So the image is small, I don't know if there's any way if we can, you know, zoom in on it, it's kind of limited, but to be able to OCR this, we can't save it because you have to pay for it. So there's probably some challenges to kind of OCR this since we can't uh, download it unless we, oh, we can. Oh, is that for free? Oh, there you go. Maybe there's an opportunity there to, to, uh, wow, cool. Never mind. <laughs> I guess, I guess maybe you have to pay for it in order to maybe get a printout. I don't know. But anyways, I think we just found a way out of it. So, um, so yeah, if we can search by county here, and there's Hood County, and then uh, you know all kinds of counties, I guess. Kaufman, Texas, I guess. Kaufman County. Kauf I guess you have to type in county. Uh, then you kind of see other uh, properties that are there. So if we usually would kind of search by state because it's just you know depending on the. The, the number that's out there right now. Uh, I, we could probably pull more by state for, for right now, but because of the COVID thingy, uh, I think that's why it's so limited. But once they start releasing foreclosures, then I believe that it's really gonna start to pick up. But uh, um, yeah, so, so yeah, I think primarily we probably wanna run a list of counties that, uh, that this is producing. And then based on those counties, we can go straight here and uh, perform those searches on the government records. Okay. And if we go anywhere else, it, they charge money and, you know, these are all basically free. So we kind of focus based on counties and then whatever cities in that county, then we'll go after them because we can see it. Okay. All right. Thanks.